Hey, how's it going, man? Good. I'm doing good. It's uh, four o'clock in the morning here in the Himalayas. We are just getting up, getting ready to go, going on the trail, going on a hike. We're going to the mountain. Mm, all right. What are we trying to do today? We're trying to get to the bazaar by eight o'clock in the morning so that we potentially can meet up with your brother. And after that, we're going to go for probably another four to six hours if we can. Mm, okay. Hiking up the trail. Sounds Let's good. Got another little tea house after yeah. our first lovely night in the. Where are we right now? I don't know, but it looks pretty dark out there. Yeah, it's pretty. Uh, pretty intimidating. Is that Mount Everest? I don't know. You don't There's know? There's really nothing quite like it. <laughs> What are you doing, Hunter? I'm gonna get shamed right now. <laughs> I'm trying to lift this, but I don't know if it's gonna work. So, just right here. Like, like that? Okay. Do I get the straps or just. Well, that's not too bad. Alright, I'll get your photo now, too. <laughs> Yeah. I'm Kashke. Wow. Wow. <laughs> that was a hundred pounds right on your back. Yeah, at least. That was crazy. And that kid probably only weighs like 80 something pounds. No, probably 110. Yeah, 110. He's just smaller than me. Uh, still, like, that's. <laughs> you think that's his body <laughs> weight or heavier? <laughs> it's like, it's like going miles. It's, it's crazy. The incline on this? Oh, yeah, he's carrying these people's stuff. <laughs> Oh, you go, come on. Ah, okay, hi. Namaste. <laughs> Namaste. We're about to get turned around to the checkpoint. <laughs> God damn it. How much is the ticket? The ticket's 3,900 Nepalese rupees. And we went through the checkpoint this morning and nobody was there, so we couldn't buy one. So we hiked all day. Now there's another checkpoint, and it's like they're going to ask for it. We don't have it. And we just hope that we can buy it there. And if they don't, then we're gonna have to travel an entire day backtracking to get it, if not two, and then come, I don't know, it's gonna be a total mess. But. Well, I guess we'll just see what happens at the checkpoint. Yeah. Here we have Namchi Bazaar. It's a pretty big town in the Himalayas. <laughs> Is there? Is there? Yeah. Oh, wow. Is that Yakko? No picture. No picture. No picture. I was wondering, what is your um, opinion on this? Is it a real Yeti head? Most of the people just they believe it. They believe it. In your culture here, has many of them seen contacts of of Yeti? No, no, but very rarely. Yeah, yeah. Okay, because in the Northwest we have lots of Bigfoot sightings, and four of my friends have have seen them personally. Oh, really? And so, so I'd like to, yeah, like just get a little more information uh, on no, on if Yeti. You, yeah, if you if you've been in, uh, if you have time in. For Kunjung, Kunjung. Mostly, you can yeah. see and um, maybe they, they, they give you more okay. information. On our way down, we will stop there. Kunjung. And then I'll come here for, sure. for lunch sure. with you. Sure. Sure. And I'll, I'll give you more information. Yeah, but uh, yeah. but it seems like a lot of people believe in it. Yeah. 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 Pretty cool. Alright, what's your name? 
Pay my shit, pay my shit. Yeah. <laughs> I have a cool extra finger. Yeah. So just extra thumb, yeah? Yeah, just thumb. Uh, okay. Yeah, I can move with the thumb. <laughs> oh, yeah. Have yeah. you had any advantages in life by having the extra finger, by doing something? Uh, I didn't know. I haven't had it. You haven't had a yeah, use for it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> one day you'll yeah. maybe discover it. Just I heard one actor in India with one hand. Oh, okay. Yeah. Alright, so now we're going to leave Namchi Bazaar. Yeah. And we're going to go to where? We're going to Tingoche tonight. Che. How long should it take us? Four and a half hours. Five. Five hours. <laughs> seven hours. <laughs> yeah. No. We'll you think we'll make it? We'll get there by dark. We'll get there by dark. There's, there's by dark? Yeti. Yeti will be chasing us home. Right. Yeti's in a monastery. <laughs> Yeti's in a monastery. <laughs> yeah, like how much crazy <laughs> does that get? This could be the start of a really good horror film. <laughs> <laughs> hey Hunter. Sit. So you say don't stand behind horses? Don't stand behind horses or donkeys <laughs> or mules. I think these are quarter horses. Or, I believe they're Nepalese mountain ponies. Do they understand you? Yeah, hey, what's your name? Can I get some water? <laughs> <laughs> you don't look like you're having a very good time. Just staring at the ground all depressed. You got a nice bell. Gotta be happy about that. This is a loan. How about this guy? No. You want an apple? <laughs> Sorry, it's got dirt on it. Yeah. <laughs> he likes apples, he's a horse. I love you too. <laughs> I found a new best friend. Megan's in trouble. We got a, a new suitor. Wait, let me check. Oh, never mind. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> A day in Amche, you would do that trek. A lot of people oh, do it. They, it's called the Everest Lodge, Lodge view. And uh, here we go. This <laughs> is documenting. Documenting it. it. <laughs> ah! is that you gotta catch every moment. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna burn some of this on the way. These are cedar. I'm pretty sure. Like really, like so like that's low. It's a cedar bush. Yeah, it's like a high altitude, low bush cedar. It's crazy. Yeah, not a juniper. Totally a cedar. That's I heard this hike is a lot easier than Kilimanjaro. Really? Yeah. yeah. Huh. But I, I kind of doubt that. I'm surprised that I'm able to even breathe up here. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> I don't know. Living. Feet. Well, I live at sea level, and a lot of my time I spend below sea level, like a hundred feet or uh -huh. like, you know, three atmospheres or whatever below sea level. Man, I can't believe we're doing this. We got three of us. To yeah. yeah. We're going to be coming down from base camp and there's a fork right in the valley. Right. That, we were talking about that at the airport, right? Yeah. It, but it's going to add a little, about an extra day. No, you guys are way ahead of stuff. Yeah? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Point at this pace? Yeah. So if you go Ting Boucher, will you lay over in Ting Boucher? Probably. Maybe, yeah. We can, we need to acclimate somewhere. I can't, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I it has to happen at some point. Yesterday, uh, at 3 p.m. in Namche. Oh. So I've, I've been here for one, uh, 24 hours. Right. I've, and then I hiked up there this morning. Yeah, it must have been beautiful. It was. And then I took a two hour nap, and now I'm ready to go. Yeah. But these yeah. guys are, they <laughs> stayed the night where? We, yeah, just down in between. The best way to do it, I think, would just be to bring a pair of jogging shorts and like a shirt and then just a huge wad of cash. And you just jog or sprint basically up the entire way. And then every time you need something, you just, I need a coat, I'm cold. Okay, I'm gonna buy a coat for a quarter of the price you would find it in the United States. You're saving money there, and you also don't have to bring it back with you. You just give it back when you're done. It makes way more sense. What did you bring with you? I, I didn't really bring the suspenders. <laughs> I brought what you see. <laughs> I brought nothing. Socks. <laughs> uh, I did bring five pairs of socks. I brought only three pairs of underwear though, so you guys but did watch you have, your underpants. <laughs> well, I got three pairs of underwear and three pairs of socks. Yeah, see that's, I brought short like the ankle socks too, for some of it, but. I brought, and it honestly like, it seems like a really wasteful thing, but my socks are all pretty old anyway, yeah. so when they get really dirty, I've just been throwing them. Hey, let's all stand there now. Yeah. All right, what's the news, Hunter? I got this sweet panoramic photo of you. I don't know, we're just here uh, hiking up to Mount Everest's base camp in Nepal. All right, so we are 
our second day into this Mount Everest hike. We're hoping to do it in a lot less time than others have done it, so we're aiming for six days to get to the top instead of eight to ten days. But we're doing good. I got my Himalayan snowsuit in here, which will come in handy once we get to the snow levels. And all my other gear in my backpack. Good weather so far. We haven't encountered any rain. That's what you plan on doing next time, Hunter? Yeah, yeah, that's my plan. That guy's got, that, he's got a bag full of money on his back. That's what he's doing. <laughs> that's the way to do it. Around. <laughs> if you want to do it light, that's the way you do it. <laughs> yeah, you get a big bag of money and you just jog. You want to do it fast, that's the way you do it. Yeah. How many of you have this year? Three. What, what? Uh, do you want these? No, no, no. All of these. You have to try it here. Yeah. Oh. That's so good. <laughs> yeah. you know, this, this it's like Gouda almost, but it's Oh, so really? Mm. Huh. This, 300. Yeah. 300, okay? Okay, 300. Cool. Can we video? Okay. Now we are arriving to Tenboche. After 4.5 hours, 6 hours of rest, and another 5.5 hours of hiking. So 10 hours of total for Hunter and me. <laughs> hey Hunter. What's up? You think Megan can make it? Oh, yes, I do. I think she could make it. You'll find out, huh? We'll find out. When you invite her. When I invite her. <laughs> I think she can make it. She will be very angry with me for bringing her, but... I'll be following you on the trip. Yeah. Yeah, I, might, I might join you again. <laughs> Alright. Well, so... <laughs> How much is it to enter? For Nepalese, I think... $25. Wow. Or in maybe $50. Is that cheap? Dude, could we do it? Yeah, do you want to do the marathon? I want to do it. No way, I'll film you. You want to film me doing it? Yeah. I'll do it. <laughs> I brought running shoes. And shorts. And a shirt. I can do it. Oh. I have all the necessary gear to do the Everest marathon. Good luck, man. Thank you. Let's do it. Uh, I'll be running like... down just... <laughs> 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 all the way down. <laughs> Oh, this is gonna be cool. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be great. Uh, do we have enough time? Well, how long does it take? Four hours? Well, I mean, the 29th, we have to be back by the 31st. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's possible. Yeah. Should we do the Everest Marathon? I got plenty of time, it's just you. <laughs> I'm fine, I could totally do it, man. If it's downhill, oh, yeah, that's easier. it's all down. Yeah, even if you walked, you could still go fast. Do we be seated on Shane one day? What are you planning? You got, you got more time than me. Yeah, I got until June 11. <laughs> well, I, I have <laughs> as much time as you. How did you get, how did you get more time? What did Megan say? <laughs> she said, you don't just run marathons, <laughs> you have to train. And yeah, what are you thinking about doing now? I don't know, maybe we just run a marathon at like, um, Base camp? Yeah, base camp, Everest base camp. That's good. From 18,000. Yeah, 18,000. I like it. Oh, you're I'm sorry, sweetie. <laughs> You're a go-getter. <laughs> Thank you so much. Wow, that's fancy. It's like an airplane. <laughs> Thank you so much. Hey, where's our pet dog? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Uh, <laughs>